Hello again, this is Manny, Manny B. Apondo, and I'm here to draw um, on the Mandarin, on a Mandarin, a picture of Jack Skellington. He's one of my favorite characters out there, and what I'm thinking about doing with, with the Mandarin, you know, I kind of feel guilty each and every year to to contribute into cavities into some of the kids out there so as an alternative I'm thinking about giving away for uh, Halloween instead of candy or along with some candy uh, mandarins but I just don't want want them to be plain mandarins uh, by themselves so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw using a uh, this is an extra fine uh, deco color. I got this one if I'm recall if I recall correctly at uh, one of the arts and crafts stores. But it's a paint marker, and it's a it's a fine tip one, so or extra fine. So the uh, the details are gonna the detail with the marker is gonna be extra extra fine. And but since they're very small, uh, th this is kind of like I just drew one right now, and. As you can see, I just this is a freehand drawing, and uh, I, I, my daughter uh, corrected me because they're like that. You did it upside down. It should have been like this, and I agree with them. But having a short attention span, I ended up doing it upside down. But this one will be correct in a little bit. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my computer and go and do just a. A Google search for Jack Skellington and I'm gonna do a freehand drawing on the Mandarin and see how it comes out stay tuned and here we go ladies and gentlemen um, this again was a freehand sketch of Jack Skellington this time I got it correct so my daughters won't tell me that I got it I got it wrong and uh, I improvised a little bit on um, I went on Google and I was able to find a few images of um, of Jack, as you can see, and I did a freehand drawing again, and this is what I came out. And again, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. It didn't even take me, gosh, probably like less than two minutes to do this entire thing. And what I like about these paint markers, again that once they dry up they they leave a they leave a nice glossy uh, surface and uh, black uh, the, the black paint dries and it leaves a little glossy surface and they come out looking pretty pretty nice uh, this is again the one I just finished uh, with Jack Skellington and my previous one but notice like how the paint dries up and it doesn't smear and again this is a a paint marker you can purchase these at your local hardware store or, or arts and crafts store and as you can see this is uh, surprisingly it says opaque paint marker but I end up getting a glossy a glossy the surface once the paint dries so again these are nice little alternatives to candy or even if you're gonna have a Halloween party so children can enjoy something healthy again this is maybe a pondo and thanks for watching